Thank you, Dean Moriarty, and welcome. Now, as we transition to the groundbreaking, we would like to share with you our concept for the future wing. The design process was guided by our educational mission and learning model. The diversity, experience, and talents of our international participants, our faculty and staff, and the premium we place on face-to-face -face dialogue and the free and open exchange of ideas. The design also recognizes our host culture and this unique sense of place with an emphasis on environmental stewardship and sustainability. The virtual tour starts right outside this building. We are now approaching the new wing. We enter through one of two halls leading to the multifunction learning area that will have seating for 108. A retractable, retractable wall allows for quick reconfiguration of this large area into two rooms that can accommodate 50 participants each. The tropical floral motif from the original Malahia Hall will be incorporated into the plenary and seminar rooms. The six seminar rooms will be configured with state-of-the-art education technology to enable collaborative, experiential learning and the sharing of ideas and perspectives. The interior walls will be demountable, allowing our successors to remodel without expensive and time-consuming demolition. As we swing around the exterior of the building, you will note the low-profile design complements our existing campus and remains well below the treetops. The roof is designed to maximize solar energy capture by photovoltaic arrays. And the courtyard incorporates our iconic monkey pod tree. The landscaping will also include a botanical garden of native plants sustained by a rainwater capture system. We thank our partners and advisors in the Waikiki Neighborhood Board, the Waikiki Improvement Association, the Outdoor Circle, the State Historic Preservation Office, the City and County of Honolulu, Army Garrison's Directorate of Public Works, Master Planning, and Cultural Resources sections, the Pacific Command J4 and J6, and the Halekoa Hotel for their assistance. We especially thank INK Architects and Lead Architect Stuart Zhao for their creativity and teamwork, and Gordon Kuioka, Army Corps of Engineers, as they turn the ideas and aspirations of our faculty and staff into a design now ready for construction. Ladies and gentlemen, in keeping with our participatory learning model, we ask all of you, guests, as well as our staff and faculty, to be a part of the groundbreaking. To ensure we are all positioned appropriately and safely for this collective experience, Please follow the instructions of our guides. They will direct our exit by row, starting from the rear. Mahalo. See you out.